Hey guys, this is Ken. In this video, I'm going to show you my top 10 new Cydia tweaks and apps for iOS 5. These Cydia tweaks and apps are very new. Uh, most of them came out in December, which is this month. Some of them came out last month in late November, so they're fairly new. If you haven't checked out my video that I made last month, you can click the annotation on the screen right there and watch that video contains some awesome tweaks as well so let's get started the first one is called blurry NC background this is number 10 so this is a notification center tweak so this basically blurs your um, background in your notification center so it does look pretty nice and uh, let me try this somewhere else say let's open up Facebook and pull it down it's still um, blurried Facebook in the background now moving on to number nine this one is called new tab search so let's open up the Safari and here we are in apple.com slash iPod touch and so let's search something so let's search iPhone and then you click search this basically lets you open another tab without um, closing the apple.com so let's try this one more time just to prove that I have only one tab open so let's type something random and search as you can see it creates another tab right there so let's open the tab and you can still go back to apple.com which is a pretty neat feature the next one is called lock screen multitasking yep this basically lets you enable multitasking in your lock screen. So double tap and there you can see you're multitasking. So let's open up settings and it works. So that was lock screen multitasking. Next we got preference folder. So hey, hey, so settings, and let's create a new folder and click here. Edit, rename, so let's just test and you can basically enable um, different things in this folder so let's open up Wi-Fi uh, all these things your favorite stuff like Twitter notes you can open up um, the blurry NC background angry birds and click done go back go back and there it is you can see test and there you go all your apps that you just selected it's in here so that is pretty much f uh, preference folders the next one is called quick note this is another notification center uh, tweak so let's open it and basically you can write notes straight in your notification center so let's click uh, video whatever Studio. okay and you click done and there you go you just took a note and it's really convenient so that was quick note the next tweak is called quick safari this basically lets you search uh, in the web by double tapping the status bar you can set this up in activator so double tap it and just basically I'm just gonna search for iPhone and click go so there it is searched it up so let me try this one more time hi go and there it is so it's working perfectly and it's really convenient and useful the next one is called switcher loader so open up switcher loader this basically lets you customize your multitasking um, bar it adds a dock in your multitasking bar so this these are my dock applications it's in my app uh, multitasking now and it lets you switch these around so let's do this right now and let's put dock icons to the last place and there it is and here is the volume controls it's right after the multitasking apps and you scroll left one more time is the music control and you swipe left one more time it's my dock apps so yeah that was switcher loader 
The next one is called ESRA. This is an app that's similar to Siri. It dictates what you say. So let's do this real quick. Whoops. Accident. Sorry. Okay, so let's do this one more time. Play music. So it just heard me. Do you want to like a music app to you? Uh, it actually talks back to you. And let's do something else. Let's see. Hello, my name is Ken. This is my YouTube video on my top 10 city of tweaks and apps of December. So let's see how it dictates, and not bad, but pretty bad. So yeah, this is ESRA. So ESRA is a pretty fun app to play around. The next one is called App Stats. This one is compatible with iOS 4 too, but it just came out for iOS 5. This basically lets you see the time and how many times you open up each application. So I opened up Safari lots of times, 32 times for 1 hour and 31 minutes. Uh, settings 50 minutes, 29 times, and all these cool stuff. So it tracks your time in each application which is pretty cool now moving on to my favorite app of the month this is a pretty big app it just came out a couple of days ago it is called sprintmize 2 yes this is a sequel to sprintmize 1 original sprintmize and sprintmize 2 basically added a lot of other features other cool features to it so let's open up sprintmize this could be the best uh, Cydia app or tweak of the year because it's so useful. So right after you open the app, you get all these options. So you can basically change everything on your iPod Touch, almost anything. So let's go to Pages. You can hide dots or disable spotlight, disable paging, and status bar. You can actually use custom carrier and enable it and then enter your name so you can um, change the iPod right there. You can also open up App Switcher. This is pretty much similar to the one that I showed you, Switcher Loader, but it ha actually has more features. And folders, you can actually hide preview, disable animation, and disable badges. That is a pretty big one. I don't really like badges and folders. And auto close, create and dock. Icons, you can now um, hide labels and do all these kind of cool stuff. And in dock, you can, uh, you know, hide dock, hide labels cover flow effect I'm not sure what that is but I'm probably gonna try it out really soon animations once again I'm gonna try out really soon so Springtimize 2 is a pretty pricey app in Cydia I think it's nine dollars or ten dollars and uh, yeah this is Springtimize 2 it's very useful uh, this contains almost most of the main Cydia tweaks in Cydia so you don't have to go download them one by one you can just download Springtimize 2 and it will have all the um, customization and features in it so this is Springtimize 2 so this is pretty much it thank you guys for watching this video if you liked it or enjoyed it please like this video right there and also take some time to subscribe i make these kind of videos all the time every month and i make top 10 games apps all these cool stuff themes and city of tweaks and apps so be sure to subscribe and also jailbreaking videos tutorials so please subscribe for more videos and i do giveaways too so make sure to enter all my giveaways and also leave a comment on how you think of all these tweaks and apps. Do you think they're useful uh, or they're not useful or you like them? Do you like them or not? So leave a comment and also share this video with your friends so more people can get these useful and awesome uh, tweaks and apps that I just showed you. So, and also favorite this video if you really liked it. So thank you for watching this video.
Hope you have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next video.